of UNE. Well, here I am. Right at the I'm at the great table, right main getaway in Biddeford, Maine. Right this I'm right off the, the uh, starting Atlantic line. Ocean here at the University of New right England. Time. And I'm really looking forward to this ride. This is my third sure ride in my five rides this year. Take advantage of all that information. I'm excited as to do 100 miles. The weather is mile. perfect. Route it's not is hot. yellow. It's the not 100 humid. mile route is yellow. It's just great. The 75 I can't wait. mile route Wish is me blue. luck. The and we're off. After the start, we uh, headed down the coast uh, pretty much uh, all the way until we got to mile 40 or so, and then we turned, uh, bit, did a big loop, and then headed inland back toward the start. The ride was beautiful. Lots of riding along the coast, lots of quaint, main, well-kept farms, lots of wildlife and just natural scenes. And even one rest area had, was complete with outdoor furniture because it was at, hosted by a furniture store. I made it. I made the Great Maine getaway. I did 100 miles today with uh, nine bonus miles due to a little miscalculation. But I had a great time. The weather was a little wet here and there, but it wasn't hot, it wasn't humid, and it was not windy. And the ride along the coast was fantastic. Kenny Bunk was wonderful. The beaches, the quaint little houses and everything. And then when we weren't by the beach, we were riding through these great tree-covered roads. It was like where the hobbits live. <laughs> so we had a, I had a great time riding and uh, looking forward to a nice meal tonight and then uh, a good ride tomorrow and some lobster. So thank you for your support to make this possible. I uh, look forward to tomorrow. Thank you. Saturday night, they had a lovely candlelight ceremony to show how MS affects so many people. They had everybody that had MS light a candle and stand up, and then everybody who had a spouse that had MS light a candle and stand up, and then everybody who had a brother or sister, everybody who had a mother or father, and so on and so forth, and everybody who worked with somebody with MS. And at the end, everybody was standing with a candle and it pointed out how pervasive MS is and what a what a far-reaching disease it is and how important that the MS Society's work is. Well here we are day two as you can tell it's a little bit damp. I'm about to head out on the 75 mile ride and uh, here I am at the starting line there's quite a few riders here Now that that formality is over, um, we're ready to go here at the uh, 75 mile day two of the Great Main Getaway. And again, thanks to you for uh, supporting my ride and supporting the MS cause. I, it's important to Patty, it's important to me, and it's important to everybody living with MS. Yesterday, I spoke with a scientist who was working on repairing myelin. And, uh, He'd had some very uh, encouraging results. So this encourages me to keep riding and uh, keep supporting this important cause. So I'm gonna get ready and get on my bike and uh, get ready to uh, go splashing through a few puddles in Maine. See you at the finish line, or maybe in between. Well, we're about halfway through the 75 mile ride on uh, day two, Sunday, and as you can see, it's a little uh, little wet here, 
It's not raining right now, but it's it's been raining and it's uh, it's been kind of damp. But the good news is the roads have been fantastic. Fairly smooth, very uh, very rural, very rural. This is in a uh, a pretty uh, pretty congested area right here. Most of what we're riding through is farms and just woods with little ponds and very scenic and very uh, very relaxing uh, hardly any traffic so this has been a been a nice ride although a little wet a little dirty but uh, I'll take it um, still happy to be here and uh, about halfway through on the 75 mile ride and uh, I'm gonna get some Gatorade maybe a couple peanut butter sandwiches and uh, keep on trucking. So, greetings from Maine. The second day ended dry and it, the weather had turned out very nice. It was a good ride except for a little oops about in the middle where I, me and my friend went on a little dirt road excursion. But the best part of course was the very end where we were treated to a lobster picnic. Well, I made it back. It was uh, it was a long day, 75 miles, but uh, got a little lost. So, me and my friend, we made 80 miles. So, oops. But I just had my lobster. The weather's dried out, and uh, it was a nice ride, and it was fun. All these people uh, riding and uh, supporting MS. So. Thank you so much for your support, and I'll see you city to shore.